and welcome back to another episode of Days Gone Survival Mode. Uh, in the last one, I spent more time than I wanted to pushing the bike along streets or like walking the bike. This time, however, I'm starting off with a full like petrol tank. And I left the petrol can next to the bike, so it shouldn't be that problem. I should be able to push on a bit more with the story, thank god. Um, but yeah, when I finished the last video, I was in the middle of clearing out this place. Come on, fellas. Uh, I don't have much ammo, though. That's the problem. Uh, actually, I can, I can take him up with a lawn mower blade. Ah, oh, cool. Yeah, that's nice. Oh my god. That was not what I was expecting. Nest residue. Uh, Freaka feces, I'm going to call that. Sounds better than nest residue. Uh, right. Throw that up there. Climb up here. Pray to whatever god is listening. Oh god, they can climb. Of course they can climb. Just not ladders. Assuming. From the last video, I, you know, did. Uh, is that the last of them? No, actually, the one I climbed. No, was it? I just remember the, it's the one of the Nero, one of the Nero checkpoints when I climbed up the Boozer, ladder for the water I tower. Those nests should be less freaks of the mountain from now on. And they couldn't climb the ladder. Had a good one there. Were there a lot of them? Nah, it wasn't too bad. That's why I wanted to take them on while it's dark out. Some of them were strong as hell, though. Yeah, cold makes them stronger. Shut eye, Boozer. Deacon out. Oh, that should be it. Hey, full gas tank. Woohoo! Alright, where am I going? This. Oh. Going to the cemetery. Yeah. I'm definitely gonna run out of ammo, uh, ammo and petrol by the time I get there. It's miles away. Am I going the right way? No. Um, yeah, it's going from day to, uh, to night time, or is it just stormy? I can't tell. Because if it's going into night, I may as well just 
go up to the bed and wait until the next day period to start. Uh, I don't know. But then again, as long as I can keep uh, good the gas tank full, I should be fine. No need to worry about stopping in the arse end of nowhere and having to walk the bike. That's the dream, anyway. To do an entire video where I don't have to walk the bike. Ow. Uh, he's probably dead now. That guy. That or his fucking stone head really <laughs> damaged my bike. What the hell is he made of? Adamantium? Jesus. Yeah, what the hell was he made of? I only hit him with the bike. Like, hit a person. No one think would damage the bike that much. Am I going the right way? Cool. So it takes a bend. Follow the next left. Oh no, not that. I don't want to do that. That's the last place I want to be. A dead end. Death anyway. Hey, I made it. Applause. Oh, that's not good. I smell a nest. Gonna be right here. I guess I'll come back here and finish burning this infestation zone later. All the supply runs around here, haven't you?
years is it gonna take before all of this is finally gone? Nice refugee camp. Yeah, we all would have been better off out in the shit. Nero couldn't protect you from a goddamn thing. Hey, what do you know? I made it across the width of the map without having to refill. Only 80% of my fuel was used. Well, 78%. That's pretty good. That, uh, yeah, gas tank upgrade does make a difference. I'll take some ammo to go, please. It sounds like all the freakers are a bit further into the camp. Yeah, here we go. It kind of gets old when you have to use that the same path to get through the camp every time the game wants you to visit the grave. It would be nice if you could just have multiple ways through it, but the eh. moment you memorize this route, you just set for the rest of the game. And there are very few little, uh, very few sort of surprises the game throws at you. There'll either be a bunch of freakers, ambushes, like people. Oh, hello. Oh, just a mix of both. Sometimes fighting each other. Which is fun to watch. Five left. Somewhere. Doing really well. Uh, That's the last time. 
Oh. All done. Hey, babe. Yeah, I, I cleaned them out. They won't be bothering you no more. Uh, hey, me again. Flashback time? Is it flashback time? I think it might be flashback time. If the game ever loads. See, can I gotta tell you something? Hey, it's okay, it's just my You told me that we shouldn't come back, and I didn't listen to you. I mean, I knew that it was getting worse, but I... None of us knew it was gonna go away for this. You don't understand. I don't know what I would do if I lost you. This is my fault. Hey. I'm not losing anyone. I made a promise. Remember? Deacon, wait! Sarah, come on. There's a kid here. Wait. Hey. Oh, shit. Hey, are you okay? Come on, we gotta find your parents, okay? Really hey. Come on. Ah! Oh. Uh, um, um, I don't know. I don't. I don't think it's that bad. Okay, what? Okay. Let's hold this. Guy. I don't think so. I think I can walk. Okay, good enough. Almost there. Okay. Two hours ago, this place was calling the feds. Yeah, they must have evacuated. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They must have bugged out. She's burning out. The uh, knife must have nicked her kidney or something. She's turning sick. Mm. How are you doing, mm. little sister? So stupid. It was this little, this little kid. This, this goddamn little kid. Big goddamn knife. Hey, help me. Mm. Hey. Mm. Oh, shit. Mm. Hey, Mom. You want to come through? We gotta get to the roof. Flag down one of those choppers. All right. See if you can rest over here. Hey. Mm -hmm. Easy, easy. <sighs> she reminded me so much of my little sister, you know. Because mm -hmm. we used to play that hide and seek game all the time. And she would just, just uh, hide her head in her coat just like that. Mm -hmm. I've been cutting my day, but nothing like that. She's burning up. Jesus. Okay. We gotta move from there. We ain't going that way. Ah. Come on. All right. Hey, sweetheart, can you move? Oh, sir. Yeah, I got her. Go find this way out. Listen to me. My girl's out there. She's been stabbed. We're just trying to get to the roof. Get out There's of a here. helicopter. You right killed her. So listen. You we're killed just... my wife. Oh no no no! I, look, you I, I didn't know anything about you. Oh, you I'm sorry, sir. No, sir. Do you need to? 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 Do you need to?
Wait, we need help. She's been wounded. Well, what's wrong with her? Well, she's not. Whatever the hell's going on out there, she's been stabbed. I can't take anymore. Oh, okay. Listen, O'Brien. If we don't get her to a hospital, she's going to die. There are no more hospitals. <laughs> oh, come on. No more hospitals. You got uh, doctors, you got triage, you got a mass unit. Oh, look, I'm just a grad student, okay? I, I got volunteers for this. I'm not even supposed to be out here, okay? Brian. Okay. Shit. Uh, I've only got room for two of you, okay? Two. Why well, you got room for two We're of you? We're overweight, what? okay? I can only take two of you. Two. <laughs> Come on, help me, come on. Come on, sweetheart. That's okay. You're gonna be all right. I got her. You're gonna be right back. Okay, Boozer, let's go. We gotta get on that guy. We gotta get on that chopper. I heard what he said. There's only room for two on that chopper. Go. Go with her. I'll be okay. Shit in this before. You know? Here we go. Where are you going? What? Where? Where? Refugee camp, west of Three Finger Jack. No. Boozer is never gonna make it without me. He's gone. gone, no go. Nope. Alright. Uh, as a nice little flashback sequence, all things said. Uh, I would have liked it if they just added... They didn't focus on things we already saw. Because that's the longest parts of that. The, 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 the intro to the game, basically. They're the longest sequences in that flashback part. But I would have liked it if they just touched upon the first few seconds of those and just skipped over them. Maybe add the flashback of Boozer and him going you, to uh, this camp. You rest easy. Okay. Seeing it overrun, I would like that. You and, uh, I know. Yeah, you wouldn't want me to, but I guess Boozer's right. I can't, I can't help myself. It's uh, it's like I said. I'll be back. What did you do? I have no idea. I remember and finding Nero. Finding Nero is twenty three percent. Cool. Search for some search uh, searching for something. Drive to location. Boozer! Another Nero chopper. Wonder what the hell they're up to. Ah, Boozer don't care. I do wonder if they'll be releasing DLC for this game. Because they haven't announced anything yet. Except, I think, I think the only thing they've added to the... Ooh. Oh, you got to be shitting me. Uh, boom. Uh, the only thing they've added to the game is this survival mode. And uh, the challenges part of the game. Where you can do certain things in the game and unlock something. I'm not quite sure how all well that works. Not really interested in it myself. Um, but yeah, I'm curious to see if they've released DLC for it. Story DLC. Now that's, that's something I might actually pay for. 
don't really, I don't tend to go into DLC that much, but I might actually pay for that. Time jump to day and then back to night again. So Deacon's just been standing there for about 36 hours. Uh, that would have been a good screenshot. You went up there again, didn't you? After I told you not to. Fuck! I... Just leave it. Right, I'm just out hunting for each boozer. You got that? Bounties! The only reason that I go up there. That's the closest I'm getting to a high-speed car chase on this, I think. Because you don't really get chased by guys on bikes. You chase them, they don't chase you. The wolves chase you. So... Whoa, whoa, whoa! Hold on, hold on, they're slowing down. Looks like they're stopping. They did not make Dick. much progress. Dick, what's going on? Son of a bitch. But what happened? You okay? No, 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 I'm fine. I'm fine. I think they were just, uh, warning shots. I mean, if they were trying to hit me, I would be dead. Dick, remember me telling you about that death wish of yours? Yeah, 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 I got this. Dick it out. Like, when they shot me off the bike, did they just stay there? To let me get the bike back up? And then carry on. Because that's nice of them if they did. But I'm just saying, it's weird. Why shoot me off the bike if they're just going to not go anywhere? 
in any hurry, at least. Just seems like a waste of ammo. Trank isn't working. No, oh, it's working. Oh, this little oh, shit we've torn your head off right now. Come on, Doc. Oh, Stay up. Oh, 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 Calm the hell down. They're coming. Give me a minute. Put on there now, don't I? Bandage. How thoughtful. How thoughtful of them. Hey! God damn it, get back here with that! How'd that shit, little shit mine. creep up on me? Jesus Christ, this shit's going to be fast. So, what the hell are they doing? Looked like they were out here... Shit, wrangling freaks, I don't know. They had a newt in some kind of noose, like they were putting a tracking device on it or something. What? Wrangling? What, what do you mean? You know, like tying it up, taking samples from it or something, like those guys used to do on that wildlife show. Pretty fucked up. They got chased off by swarmers, bugged the hell out. They left some gear behind, a radio. Wait, you don't, you don't think that Sarah... No, no, not, I, I, I don't know. I'm just, and he's alive, Boozer, he's alive. O'Brien, one of them, Nero. I'm gonna track him down, if I can. I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get some answers. Damn it. Okay. Look, I'll be able to ride soon. I'll help you, Deke. If he's alive, we'll find the bastard. You're goddamn right. I'm gonna check in later. Deacon out. Okay, O'Brien. Where the hell are you? More flashbacks. Woo!
So I'm sort of lost. I was hoping you could help me out. I'm sorry, you're lost? Yeah, yeah, I'm looking for the old Belknap Road, and there's not a lot of signs around here. <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. Nope. What? What is it? What? Oh. It's <laughs> great. That is just perfect. <laughs> that, that is great. That is great. So about those directions? <laughs> I'm really sorry. I, I don't know where Belknap, Belknap, Belknee, Belknap, Belknap. That's the one. And I don't know where it is. I really can't help you. I'm sorry. So no, then. <sighs> nope. Okay. Well, thanks anyway. Hey. <sighs> All right. <laughs> could you use a ride? Yes, I could. Thank you for finally offering. I'm Sarah. I'm Deacon. Oh, well, sorry about the mess. <clears throat> um, I don't, how do I, uh, this contraption? Pretty much what you think, just throw your I just... leg over, yeah. Okay, um, there. Whoa. Okay. <clears throat> Ready. Hey! <laughs> hey! Hold on tight. Thank you so much. No problem. It's just, there are no bars out here, so... Well, sure there is. There's a place called Crazy Willie's up the road. There's, uh... No, I meant cell phone reception. I know what you meant. Right, of course. Anyway. So what's a nice girl like you doing in a place like this? <laughs> you know, I ask myself that all the time. I do research. Um, you know, I study things. Thanks. Had no idea what research was. Sorry, um, I do plants. You study plants? Yeah. Hey, hey, look out! Shit! Oh. Are you okay? I'm just... Oh, Lordy, that was close. Hey. You sure you're okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I just... Oh, my God. Hey. Hey. I've got cell phone reception. Hey. Yeah, I'm fine. I just... The car you gave me, it's a real piece of shit. I need a tow. I'm on, um, I don't know, some, I don't know where Road I am. Road 42. Road 42? Yeah, I'm, I'm about a mile up. Okay, I'll see you when you get here. Come on, I'll take you back to your car. We can wait for the tow truck. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. Well, all right. I'm sure when those boys come back, they'd be happy to give you a ride, so. <laughs> okay, all right. All right, I just... Just give me a second. There'll be any minute now, All right, so... all right, all right, screw it, let's go. Just drive a little careful this time, okay? <laughs> you weren't really lost, were you? Well, that all depends on who you ask. My ex would say I've been lost for years. Well, you certainly know your way around here. So you're not from around here? No, I'm from Seattle. The company that I work for, they just, they opened this lab here, so... Here I came to the middle of nowhere. To research plants. That's right, I already told you I forgot. Um, yeah, so, the company that I work for, they, they do work for this bioengineering firm, and, um, some of the plants that I, I look at are pretty rare, and they just happen to grow here. That has got to be the best thing I've ever heard. Oh, what the hell? Clean! We got company! Oh, shit. All right, gentlemen. Yeah. 
<laughs> Alright, so I don't get to drive or anything, but I do get to fight. Or uh, rather, get the shit kicked out of me. Get the shit kicked out of me by hillbillies, I might add. Hit him again. Now you like that bike, love boy. Do it. Come on, hit him. Not so tough now. Hit him. Are you? <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, you don't learn, do you, bike boy? Oh, yes. Oh. Yes. Oh, I'll teach you. I'll teach you good. Yeah, you like that? How about that? Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Yeah, I'm out. Hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold Roll, goddammit. Roll. Oh. Oh, Jesus. Oh, my God. No, no, no. Uh, oh, my God. Hey. I'm so sorry. No, no, no. I, I don't even know. I just was looking in your bag, and no, it's I, I right. saw that, and I... No. Oh, my God, I could have killed somebody. Well... Oh, shit. Yeah, but you, you gotta kind of aim it at them first. I've never done anything like that before. Hey, I saw, it's okay, it's okay. I They're saw gone. it in They're your gone. bag, and I just I tried to call you the police, good. but there were no You know what we're, no gonna we're gonna There's do? There's no reception. I'm gonna wait right here. Until your guy comes. Okay. Thank you. I've never done anything like that. Huh. Could have fooled me. Yeah? Now, the last, not back, not those flashbacks, but the ones before that, like, you know, I was a bit iffy on, but I do like the flashbacks that are just about him and her and how they met. Those are pretty nice. They, do, they, they develop quite a nice little, like, bond between the both of them. Tucker. Hot Springs Camp. You there? I'm gonna need more info on that survivor Larson spotted in Marion Forks. Deacon. I already told you everything I know. Young, a woman. Wait. He mentioned Hungry Jim's. That old pancake house by the East Bridge. Lumberjack. Big stack of pancakes. Yeah, I know the one. Okay, I'll start there. You do that. And remember, bring her to me. A group of drifters came through the other day, traded us a few guns. Maybe something you could use. I'll keep that in mind. Deacon out. Ah, right, yeah, so it kind of doesn't, doesn't feel forced, like when they'll, when you see them meet and so on, it doesn't feel badly written either. Return to Thought Springs Camp. I'm sure she'll just give me another job, though. There you go. Up there. So, we'll just do a U turn. This is Radio Free Oregon. The truth shall set you free. Today, I was thinking about where it all began. Now let's go deep. Back to the big WW2. 1947, the feds passed. Hello, squatter camp. The sons of bitches have been setting up ambushes now, around here, what yeah? This did was give the feds the right to take over our roads, railroads, and radio. Anything they damn well pleased. Without a warrant. Today, the feds are gone. But we're still here. Shout the spotlight of truth on the world. The truth is, I seen it coming. Years ago, we had photos. Nero death camps built to hold us, American citizens. No one believed me. If more of us had spoken up, none of this would have happened. I'll tell you one thing. It won't happen again. This is Mark Copeland for Radio Free Oregon. Don't believe the lies. Well, you were right about one thing, Cope. All these Nero refugee camps, 
They did turn out to be death camps, just not the way you were expecting. I, I can forgive a lot I, in some games. I can even forgive the fact that th those dialogue options, that like op optional dialogue, with Copeland talking absolute shit and Deacon screaming his reply into the ether. I can forgive that as well. Even if it is like a weird... Oh shit. Ah, balls. Even if it is a weird design choice. He's literally just screaming out into nothing. Yeah, I know how to repair shit. the bike. Engine crapped out. I just can't because for some reason, well, I say for some reason, we are in the river. Hmm. I can walk it out though, can't I? Yeah. Cool. I can't repair it because I don't have any scrap. Okie dokie. May as well go looking for scrap. nearing the 50 minute mark so I'm going to have to call an end to this video here. Thank you all for watching. Um, please remember to like, comment and subscribe I know I say it at the end of every video but it does mean a lot. In the comments section uh, just let me know how the commentary is if there's anything you'd like me to talk about or any pointers you want to give me uh, so on. Please put that in the comments, that would be nice and leave a like um, check out my, a few of my other playlists on my channel um, and leave a few likes and comments on those videos as well I will see you in the next part thank you all for watching again Tada!